Hi, everybody. My name is Dr. Sean Twitt. And six months ago, a good friend of mine, Dr. J.C. Dornick, introduced me to a program that has completely changed my paradigm when it comes to practice, how I deliver the message of health to patients, and how I've been living my life. So I can't say enough about this program. Dr. J.C.? Awesome. Thanks so much, Sean. Um, it's exciting. You know, it's exciting to be speaking to our brethren. Um, chiropractic is a very unique world. You know, uh, people that have made a decision to practice chiropractic all share, you know, this common bond of uh, using a natural proactive approach, swimming upstream. So this is going to be very uh, conducive to the chiropractic philosophy and um, very exciting what we're able to do for our patients now. So just quickly, my story, um, this is me in May 2007 as a health professional, um, you know, not practicing what I preached. Uh, I knew everything there was to, to know about health. My parents were both professional athletes. I grew up a chiropractic kid, but as I got older, I became a product of being a workaholic and, you know, just working long, long hours at my office. Um, which made my marriage suffer. I never saw my kids, and that got me to a place where I was a very successful chiropractor, high-volume, cash-based practice, um, but everything else fell apart, and I was 75 pounds overweight. And um, when this program was offered to me, uh, I was looking for a solution, naturally, for my weight, because I wasn't practicing what I preached. People weren't taking my advice when it came to health and nutrition. And I had tried everything um, myself, but when I found this program, it was a natural um, desire to lose weight. So I went on the program that we're going to introduce here. In about three quick months, I lost about 50 pounds. So as you can imagine, I felt better. I got that fire back inside of me. I started to wake up. I got excited about life again. Um, but as you know, losing weight doesn't mean you're healthy. Um, but the nature of this program, I had a coach and I was introduced to this philosophy that was kind of a personal growth, self-discovery, um, you know, kind of a realm for me. And that was very comfortable. But I really engaged in the program we're about to talk to you. And I achieved what I consider optimal health. Now, optimal health looks differently for everybody. Um, not everybody wants to get in the best shape possible. But what we're going to talk about is the idea of meeting people where they're at. I was not in a great place. Giving them a solution to get started, achieve a level of health where they'll awaken and really, really look to take control of their life. So you just saw my before and after picture, um, but this is my after after picture, you know, because the truth is that people don't wake up and decide, hey, I'm gonna get unhealthy. You know, the people coming in your office don't want to be unhealthy. So if we don't look upstream from the cause of disease, you know, we talk a lot about the cause of disease, but what's the cause of the cause of disease? For me, I was depressed. Uh, I, was, I was never seeing my kids. All I really wanted to do was see my kids. So my after-after picture, this is me as head coach of my kids' football team, where I freed up a lot of my time, and I'm spending quality time with things that matter most to me. So think about what that, um, how that translates into your life. So just a little background, our story, our credibility, our mission. Um, Optavia is, is a professional coaching company that provides that support and guidance and accountability to our clients with a program that was created about 40 years ago by a company, our parent company called Metafast. Been here about 40 years. Um, publicly traded company, made in the USA. Um, Optavia was a company that was created by this gentleman there named Dr. Wayne Scott Anderson. Um, he was a critical care physician and he knew that the mother and father of all disease, because he was seeing people at the end, was obesity and poor nutrition, poor lifestyle, um, weight loss, that, that whole realm was the mother and father. So he wanted to find a credible company that made products that were, you know, nutritious, took care of the, uh, the calories and things like that. And he wanted to swim upstream and take care of the mother and father of all disease. So this is a gentleman that went and quit his job as a very successful critical care physician and went upstream. What attracted me to him and why I, I asked him to be my mentor is he spoke our language as chiropractors. He's trained, even though he's a critical care physician, he was trained as an osteopath. And all I ever heard him say was swim upstream. Um, you know, drugs and surgery are not the solution. We need to go upstream and find the cause of disease. So I was all in. So what we offer our patients is a comprehensive program for optimal health. So if you think about all your patients, take a step aside from what you think for a second. Let's think about our patients, you know. 
patients want to reach a healthy weight, right? People want to lose weight, and that's that quick fix mentality. But with the support of a coach and community, while learning habits, they're going to create health for a lifetime. Now, think about it. The reason why people lose weight and then gain it back is they never address the fact that their weight gain was caused by unhealthy habits that they practice day in and day out. So what we're doing is, is we're using this portal of entry of weight loss to give them results. But what we really do, it's almost like we're habits coaches. We're teaching them small micro habits to practice long enough so that it will create a new normal and they'll manifest longevity and health. So here's some results. Here's Ron and Shirley, you know, your typical patients, typical friends, family that come in and, you know, you, you can imagine that they don't feel good, but they also are hosts of drugs and surgeries being done and all that stuff. They go on this program, they not only lose health, but they create radiant health, optimal health. Um, this is a great picture because the gentleman on the left, uh, Dominic Taranelli, he was the one that walked into my office. And you know what's funny about chiropractors? When I was really entrenched in my practice, um, I just remember if somebody walked into my office and and said like, hey, I've got a case, a briefcase full of cash, you know, and I'd say, you know what, no thanks, I'll refer people to you. So I used to say no to everything, but this guy came into my office on a day that I personally was looking for a solution. I gave him my credit card. I had no idea that I was going to offer this to my patients. But uh, when I saw what him and his wife looked like from the program, I said it's worth a try. So this program that we're going to offer you right now is really changing people's lives, you know, and it's not just about weight loss, it's about creating health. Now just imagine, you know, just for a second as a chiropractor, think about what your mission and goal is when you put somebody on your table. Um, it's not to just, you know, get rid of their pain or get rid of their subluxation or whatever it is. It's to put them in a position where they can handle adversity with grace and, and you know, create optimal health. So what a better, you know, way of looking at this, but visible, visible, um, measurable results. Mm -hmm. This is a great one. This is Dr. Joe, um, a medical professional, vascular surgeon. You know, one of the things about Dr. Joe is Dr. Joe went on the program because he was actually having trouble approaching the surgical table. Just imagine that, you know, unhealthy people getting surgery and getting worked on by somebody that can't even approach the table. Funny thing about Dr. Joe is Dr. Joe had a, a lot of struggle going on the program saying, I don't eat this, I don't eat that. And I said, well, what are you eating? Because you're eating too much of it. So Dr. Jo Joe goes on the program, lost over 100 pounds. So this is a physician. You know, this is somebody out there affecting all of these patients. So, yeah, we've got a big problem. We've got a big problem because a lot of these people we're trying to help are being led by people that need help themselves. Mm -hmm. So we talk a lot about predictable transformation. What I love about chiropractic is I know that if somebody comes in my office, regardless of what they have, if they stick to my care plan, I know the outcome. Same thing with this. If somebody goes on this program and sticks to it, not only are they going to predictably lose weight, and create a better situation of health, but they're also gonna to move towards this idea of optimal health. So there's a health epidemic. I mean, let's just look at the facts. Like I said, step aside from what you think people need and look what's going on out there regardless of what we're offering people. You know, the percentage of adults aged 20 years and over with obesity, now that's obesity, that's 37%. 37% of everyone you know in America is obese. And that's by the way, a study done in 2013 to 2014. Side note, it's gotten a lot worse since then. Percentage of adults age 20 or over that are overweight in general, 70%. So this is a huge, huge problem. Um, think in terms of what it is that we want to do to grow our practices. Well, we need people to need us, right? So we don't like to talk a lot about back pain, some of us, and we don't like to talk about the, the, the getting rid of, uh, of symptoms and stuff, but very often that's why people th think they need chiropractors, you know, unless we go out and educate the population about the benefits of it. But you want to talk about a huge demand out there? I mean, look at these studies. I know Sean, Dr. Sean is from Kentucky, and they're showing up in the uh, orange there. And then as you can see, as we go, it's getting even worse. It's to the point now, this is just a study in 2015 where you're seeing some states are over 35%. Um, it's getting to the point now where states like Colorado, which are in general healthy states, are actually showing a substantial rise in obesity. Now, what's the danger of obesity? 
Well, overweight and obesity, as you can imagine, as a chiropractor, putting stress on the body. We know that if we're not eradicating or addressing that, people need to probably go out to their car after an adjustment, turn back around and come right back, if we're really telling the truth. I mean, I remember I was very big on leg checks and holding adjustments, and I would watch them through my treatment window, walk back to their car, and I would kind of grit my teeth knowing, you know, did I really help them? And uh, I used to boast a lot about how many visits I would see each patient per year, but you know what? Um, do, did I really need to see them if they manifested a better level, level of health? I'm a healthy guy now, and I know how, how often I get adjusted. It's a part of my regimen, but it's less than I did when I was 75 pounds overweight. So insulin resistance, diabetes, mellitus, cardiovascular disease, these are all things that are happening. We're seeing them. If we really dive deep in our health assessments with our, with our patients coming in, they're all suffering from all these things. Now, what's a chiropractic philosophy that most of us use? And it's just a logical approach to the way health manifests. If we remove interference and we restore health potential, we give the body a better chance to handle adversity. Now, we know that stress, trauma, adversity, it's inevitable, inevitable that's going to happen. But if we put the body in a better chance, it's going to handle it with grace. So the idea of reaching a healthy weight is going to reduce a lot of things that a lot of people are coming in. Now, chiropractic is a habit of health. Everybody needs a healthy you know, nervous system. But look at all these things that are coming in that are affected by obesity. Do you know that if somebody is obese, they have a 300% chance, increased chance of cancer. So all of these other problems that our patients have that are not going away just from an adjustment, we're going to handle this now in our office. And that's a chiropractic approach, giving them a, the ability to manifest a better life. So basically, we all come into this world healthy, except for about 5% that are born with that, those those challenges. So the current path of health is that very quickly in this society, we're getting unhealthy and we're going down. Now, the medical profession is good at one thing, keeping people alive, but the quality of living that they're keeping them alive on breathing machines and ventilators and medications, it's terrible. So what's happening in the future, if we keep going this way, it's going to get even worse, meaning people are going to get sicker quicker, and then you're going to see the focus of medicine is keeping people alive. This is about a new projected health path where we're helping people manifest their best level of op optimal health so that they can handle adversity and optimize their experience in life. Very chiropractic philosophy. This is actually a very good friend of mine here, Wynn Calgill, who uh, has obviously transformed his health, but it's a two-phase approach. You know, in chiropractic, we really look at it in some way, shape, or form as a three-phase approach. People come in in some form of the acute phase. We address that. We try our best to make corrections from what we do, but also we want to make corrections and stuff they do at home so that they can maintain this level of health and wellness. But what we really want to do is we want to help people create a new level of health even after we get rid of their problems and make correction. So we have a two-phase approach which is we help people reach a healthy weight, but in phase two, we're teaching them new habits that they can practice to create a new normal. Remember, people do not wake up and decide to be unhealthy. They're unhealthy and overweight and obese because of their bad habits that they're approaching. So we don't just address the problem. We address the problem and we teach corrective new healthy habits. And once they practice them for a long time, they will maintain their weight loss, but we want to create a new reality where they optimize their health so it doesn't stop there. Think about the diet industry just quickly. The diet industry is focused on one thing. When Oprah and Marie Osmond tell you you can eat bread and, and lose weight, What's the goal? The goal is weight loss. And the reason why 85% of people gain their weight back is they stop at step two. Step two is weight loss. So people think about going on a diet and they go on a diet and you know what? Diets do work. They help you lose weight and 85% of people gain it back. And the reason why is they never go through a transition process and build over time these new healthy habits and they never even look at that new idea of optimizing their health and living a longer radiant life. So our program, Optavia, really picks up where diets leave off. So for those of you that look at diets and say, I don't like diets because it's a quick fix. That's a very chiropractic thing to say. That's why I didn't like diets. Nutrisystem, Jenny Craig, Weight Watchers. I never saw long-term results in health. So you're going to love this program because we take people all the way. And frankly, people get to go as far as they want with health with this program. So if you look at the idea of healthy body, someone wakes up and they say, I want to get healthy. 
They very often focus on what it is they know, and they say, I want to lose weight, or in chiropractic terms, get rid of pain. But we, in this program, when they're ready, we introduce them to new ideas like healthy eating and nutrition and motion and sleep and stress reduction, all within the realms, and hydration, by the way, all within the realms of practicing new healthy habits so that you can take this car out for a ride and continue to do so. So healthy body is expanded. So if you look at the diet industry and there's just that focus of losing weight, that's why people are gaining it back. They're not losing, they're not gaining any knowledge, they're not creating new habits, they're not getting the support, and they're also probably in a bad supportive uh, network. So our program offers four components, and this is really, really key. When your patients, when your clients, your friends, your family go on this program, they get a health coach. Somebody is gonna be there knee to knee, whether it's over the phone, text, email, or in person, getting to know that person, their unique struggles, and they're gonna be there to hold them accountable, mentor them, and, and just guide them along the path and give them information when they're ready. We call it just-in-time coaching. This is the cornerstone for their success, and whether you're referring people to the program or doing the coaching yourself and increasing your ancillary income, this is key. People cannot do things on their own. You can see what they've accomplished on their own. The second component is if they don't learn new healthy habits, they're never going to transform. If you think about health transformation and you look at anybody that enjoys health, like Dr. Twit, he doesn't even know how to spell the word fat. And if you look at his life, he practices healthy habits that keep him in that pocket. Look at an unhealthy person, they're practicing unhealthy habits. So in their box, when they get their program, they're getting this book called The Habits of Health, which is going to inlay micro habits, one little healthy habit at a time, so that they too can practice healthy habits. When I was preaching, not practicing what I preach, but I was telling people what to do. And then I had to step back and say, of course they're not doing what, they, what I do. They don't understand the value of it. So people go on the program, they get excited, and they start practicing healthy habits. Community is the third component, and it's enormous. Community means we take these people, which very often have sabotaging environments and support, and we put them in a community where they can thrive. There's online communities, Facebook groups, there's web hangouts, Google hangouts, where these people can come in and interact with thousands of other people on this program. And by the way, that community will grow in your practice, and that's a lot of fun to have support groups and gatherings. But when somebody's in a community where they can thrive, well, we know that like attracts like and like practices like like. So community is huge. Now, most of those things you just saw, they're free but they're probably 75% of the program's success. And here we go on the fourth component, a goof-proof, simple program that has structure that makes this attainable. Remember something. When somebody wants to lose weight, they're thinking calorie restriction. It, I don't even want to mention some names, but I know a lot of us in our, in our profession are using programs that are manipulating on a chemical basis people's bodies to lose weight and go into fat burn. And guess what? Yeah, you're going to lose weight and fat burn, but are you nourishing the body? Are you addressing? The more important component of weight loss is a balanced micro and macronutrient. So that's the problem. Everybody knows they need to eat less, eat more frequently, and get nutrients in their body, or else they're going to have deficits in other areas, which plays a big part in gaining weight back. So we put people on a program called the Optimal Weight 5-in-1 program that uses healthy fuelings that range from products that are attractive to the couch potato to the person that shops organic at a Whole Foods and wants non-GMO and you know kale and chia seeds sprinkled all over it. All of our products that have the Optavia label are clean label, meaning they have no artificial colors, flavors, and sweeteners, unlike any other program that a lot of us use, and they have probiotics built into it. So most people, when they use the fuelings, they're still focused on losing weight. But via the Trojan horse, we're instilling nutrition and we're teaching them these valuable mm -hmm. habits. So we're putting people on what's called the Optimal Weight 5-in-1 program, which is a goof-proof approach to handling calories and nutrition because you have to have a deficit in calories in order to burn fat because most of these people are not moving a lot. If people do have increased exercise and they do live some healthy habits, the, pro the program is modifiable. That's one of the things when we do a health assessment, we, we find out what's right for the person. And we also have fuelings that address gluten-free and you know, non-GMO and other types of allergies. But real simply put, 
Every day they're gonna eat six times, but we don't call it eating, we call it fueling. That's why we say fuelings. When you say the word fueling, rather than eating, eating is a reactionary thing we do to hunger, emotions, and things like that. Fueling is an extra step of being mindful of what's in the food. So our healthy fuelings, they're gonna eat five, and one, or five of those, and then one lean and green a day. So all they have to think about each day is they have to think about preparing this one lean and green with their family, and we wanna instill this lean and green mentality in their house, but we wanna make this program goof-proof so that they get radical, radical results pretty quickly because if you take an unhealthy person that is still in a diet mindset just like that person that comes into your office and they're in writhing pain people need to get results to open up to the next step so real quickly when people come into you and they need to lose weight you're going to see them in a situation where they're eating more than they're burning that's where fat accumulation takes place we put them on the five and one goof proof simple program that's how they're gonna to get to that fat loss. But in that process of getting the winds of being in fat burn and feeling better, mental clarity, sleeping better, energy, starting to instill these new habits of health, they're learning some things and they're changing, they're creating a new normal. Once they reach a healthy weight, you know, when their BMI is at a healthy weight or whatever they determine, we transition them to the point where they're eating less fuelings and more lean and green. And that's how we get them to the promised land where they're now health conscious people that are awakened and practicing habits of health. And guess what? We stick with them at that point and that's how we get the long-term results. So think about this. Think about your practice. Think about your, you know, what you're trying to do for your patients and think about your bottom line. You know, like I said before, I was a successful chiropractor and what came with that was working a lot, you know, working a lot in the service. You know, I remember I used to tell my kids, daddy, daddy needs to take care of the patients, you know, and I felt good about that. But as my practice grew and I became more successful, I became less successful at spending time focused on the things that matter most. So the idea of making money was not attractive because I was making money. But the idea of how I made money was very attractive. I wanted to create time freedom. So think about this for a second. The basic benefits to your practice, value added service. You know, this is something that everybody's looking for. Improve results of chiropractic care. Listen, let's get transparent for a second. If a patient that's 50 pounds or more overweight, even 10 pounds overweight, we know about the pressure on a nerve. If somebody's even 10 pounds overweight or more gets on your table and you adjust them, think about the results they'll get if they didn't carry that extra weight. Increase your referrals. When's the last time a patient of yours got an adjustment and walked through town and had everybody they know stop them and say, what the heck happened to you? You look amazing. Never. Right? Now, Sean and I claim to be the best chiropractors in the world, but that, Sean, did that ever happen to you? Did you ever have somebody ask your patients why they look so good after your adjustment? Not once in 14 years. <laughs> there you go. We're being a little bit funny, but guess what? You guys all agree if you're being honest. Yeah, true. So increase your referrals. Sure. Walking billboards to success. Everybody says, how did you do it? And they lead back to your practice. Income sources not controlled by managed care. Look, or overhead. When I started to make a couple thousand dollars doing this, I very often you know, would look at that and say, I don't have to complain and fight somebody for this money. And also there's no overhead. Um, in my practice, I was pretty good at my overhead. It was about 50%. So if I made a dollar, 50% went to the house. With this, none of it went to the house. So it's a great competitive ad, uh, advantage. Now we all wanna work together as chiropractors, but what makes your practice unique? Well, what if your practice is pumping out visible, measurable results that are walking all over town? And think for a second, how about all the family members and friends of your patients that are not coming into your office that are now gonna find out about your office when they see their family and friends losing weight, getting healthier, getting younger. So personalized service is not easily duplicated. Builds patient loyalty. When somebody transforms their health, they're never gonna leave you. Accommodates patients looking for non-drug solutions for weight loss, you know? We have a clean label approach to it, longevity. Nobody else is doing what we're doing because we've taken the time to create this idea of building the habits. We've got the science research, the books to prove it. Promotes healthcare versus sick care. That's a very chiropractic thing to do. Um, develops develops um, advocates for your practice. You know, the patients that I have, you know those patients that get really, really good care and they just really become champions to your practice? You build your practice on those referrals. Well, wait until you see what happens to anybody that completely transforms their health. They will be champions for your practice. So that's wonderful. 
So create a substantial profit center. I mean, we don't like to talk about money because we've spent so much money on our profession. We've dedicated our lives to it. Um, we only look at, there's only one way to make, make money is adjust people or do whatever you do in practice. But just think about this idea of creating a new stream of even five figures monthly end up of ancillary income what would you do? Would you practice as much as you're practicing right now? If you had this profit center that wasn't taking more work, but was coming in, you'd probably change the way you practice, spend a little bit more time with your family, travel a little bit more. No inventory. We're not buying stuff and selling it. This is not an MLM where you're buying something at a discount and pushing it. This is a professional coaching model where your patients go on the program with the company. Company handles all the delivery and all that stuff. You're not spending any money on that. You're being paid to support them. Low cost startup, you know, I'm, you know, sometimes I chuckle because I help more people legitimately in a month right now than I did my entire 17 years as a, as a chiropractor. And I had a high volume practice. So that's how much I've expanded this. Um, I spent 199 bucks to become a health coach. And you all know how much we spent on our, on our education. Now, I love being a chiropractor, but, you know, I am, I am noticing that I'm helping more people for $199. And that's what I really wanted to do. Repeat income potential. Every month, people are in different phases. You're getting results. I have patients that have been on program for 11 years now that are on a maintenance version of it. And that's repeat income. So what does this look like from the eyes of your patient? Real simple. From a mission standpoint, your practice is taking a stance at addressing the elephant in the room. They all know what's really going on in their lives. Now we have a knack in chiropractic to preach what it is that we think people should do and tell them what they should do. That's called shooting on people. And I did it for the most of my life. But the truth is, is people want to get happy and healthy and they all have real life struggles. And very often what we offer them as a solution is based on what we think in our value system for health. So what does this look like for a patient? This is you as a doctor saying, you know what, we're gonna start jumping into your world and meeting you where you're at and give you an easy, inexpensive solution to get started and take you to the promised land. So they're going to appreciate that you're doing that. Um, so who coaches these people? Keep in mind, when somebody goes on the program, somebody's got to take care of them. Somebody's got to guide them, teach them the basics of the program, uh, support them, check up on them, things like that. And for those of you that are like me or like Sean, we had a lot of work to do. We had negative free time in practice. So we need somebody to coach them. So you have two options, really. If you're not looking to make ancillary income and you're just happy with everything going on in your practice, but you just want to offer this to your patients, you can refer them to the person that offered you this video and they will take care of them. No problem. And you'll get the results. What I highly recommend is you consider the idea of us, meaning your support team, training someone in your office or you or both to do the coaching, which doesn't take a lot of time. It's real simple. It's, it's a turnkey situation. And in fact, if you look at the talk that you're giving people at the table, you're talking about health and nutrition often. So it's very easy to coach people. You can coach them off-site as well, remotely from your phone, internet, things like that. So let's talk about generating income, cash flow, and building equity. Um, think about this for a second. The weight loss industry, it's astronomical. And this is the weight loss business, the diet business, 85% fail rate. Americans are now spending over $60 billion to lose weight. That's $60 billion. Now, you can go do your research, but you want to know what the world spends, the consumer spends on chiropractic a year? It's under $2 billion in the world. We're talking about a $60 billion industry just in America. So considering the fact that 75 million Americans are actively doing this, that's $800 per person per year. Now, I don't know what percentage we're taking care of as chiropractors, but just open your mind up to not just taking care of your patients, but taking care of everybody. Now, I'm going to show you some numbers here. So we're recording this, and we just got to show you that the, the fact that if you do this and you don't do anything, you will make nothing. <laughs> so you know, this business is just like chiropractic. If you help no one in your practice, you'll just be hanging around. So let's just talk about the two different ways that you build this business. Now, in chiropractic, very often we just have one practice. We take care of our patients, and that's our business model. Most do it that way. But then we've got chiropractors that expand, open up satellite offices, have associates, and build their volume like that. So we have both of those. Now, me, myself, I, I – 
I, I boast that I take more I care of more people in a month than I did in my career as chiropractic. That's because I've duplicated myself. I've trained people like Sean and many, many other people to become coaches. So there is an expanded model in this, which is exciting. Um, from a business standpoint, I always wanted to save the world as a chiropractor, but I realized if we're going to do that, I need to be able to teach all my patients how to be chiropractors so they can take care of everybody. Because frankly, we can't take care of everybody as chiropractors. So there are two different models of doing this, but we're going to focus on one because I know the average chiropractor is just focused on taking care of their patients. But I just wanted you to know, for those of you that are entrepreneurs like myself and Sean, you can scale this and duplicate this and create some serious financial freedom. So the health coach income that you get is simply paid to you for supporting your patients on the program. So what helping people could look like as a certified health coach, if you help five patients to 25 patients, I helped 33 patients my first month. Some of those were my friends and family, but as you can see, that's a monthly income free from managed care and free from, uh, you know, overhead. So think about that. So think about this for a second. What helping people could look like if you helped more people, 50 to 60 active patients. So what I wanna do right now is I wanna let Sean talk a little bit about where he was. Sean's been doing this for about five to six months. Um, Sean, talk a little bit about you know, how you got started, what you achieved in your first two to three months. Well, <clears throat> thanks, JC. Um, this was something that was very easy to implement. I just simply shared this opportunity with some patients and I just recently had a patient come in and after being on the program for two months, he lost 45 pounds. And by day 15, his GP said, what the heck are you doing? Your blood sugar levels have dropped so rapidly in such a short amount of time. He says, you're bottoming out. He took him off his type two diabetes med and his cholesterol medication. The guy after being a type two diabetic for years, the chiropractic of course, and I'm a second generation chiropractor, wasn't fixing completely stopped. No more medication. He looks, acts, and feels like a completely different person. This was easy to implement in my practice. I had the support of JC and others in, in the community, okay, to help me bring it in. And that doesn't take a lot of time. It's very easy, very fun. And the, the health transformation that you see with people is astronomical. There's nothing out there like it. I was able to sign up 25 people without hardly any effort whatsoever within two months. Now, one other thing that, you know, I can tell you about Sean is Sean, like me, had negative, negative free time. Um, so Sean actually recruited the help of his lovely fiance, who's now his wife, and uh, they actually partnered in this, and that was another way. So for those of you that are like us that have negative free time, um, if you have a spouse or a partner or even an employee, um, it's something that you could do together. And Sean moved very, very fast, but the reason why he moved very fast is he's built a nice uh, stream of income is because he, A, he wanted freedom, but he also has a big heart for his patients and he wanted to make sure he gave them what they needed. So getting started is really easy, folks. You know, it's a turnkey operation. You get, a, you get your own website that's attached to it um, so people can, you know, learn about the program and there's full training um, and support from your team. Uh, minimal staff training. Um, in my office, I had my staff doing the program and I got to be honest with you, once I started doing this, I had so much fun doing this. I used to get so excited about the results and seeing the people get on the scale and the high fives. I started to get involved heavily in doing the coaching. Um, and that's brought me to a place now where I practice chiropractic for fun. But I was able to replace my high volume chiropractic practice with this income and it's grown exponentially since then. So I still practice chiropractic and my office sees a lot of people in the community. but. I'm not hustling anymore. Um, I'm taking care of people. I'm doing it with calm and, you know, relaxing manners. And I really give people good care. Um, but it's not a business driver for me anymore. It's something that I do because I love. Um, so I've set my office up where, you know, we're offering this program, but it's a chiropractic office. We're taking care of a lot of people. We've got some younger doctors in there that are hustling and seeing a lot of patients. But, you know, just think about that. You're going to get some business coach support, too. If you like that bigger model and you want to expand it, well, we can help you do that. So where do you go from here? You know, hopefully you enjoyed this and it was informative. Get back to the person that sent this to you. Uh, Sean and I just, from our hearts, we wanted to just share with you as the brethren and the sisters and the brothers of our amazing profession. Um, we're real passionate about recognizing 
what it is that chiropractors are trying to accomplish out there and why they've decided to become chiropractors and providing them a little bit of freedom so that they can practice better, but spend more time around the things that matter most. So get back to the person and just do what we call, have an explore call, explore the idea, share the unique differences and things that you have going on in your practice, talk about your wants and needs and see if this works for you. So once again, we have this resource, it's our, our compensation plan, you know, and how we get paid for supporting people. Um, as you can see, there's people that, have, that do nothing and get paid nothing on up to people that make over $200,000 a month doing this. So this is a legitimate company that is rated as one of the most successful stocks that has just blown up. If you wanna look that up on the New York Stock Exchange, that's MED. Um, just go look at that. You'll probably call the person right after when you see that. And we've also just announced we're expanding to Asia. So think for a second, you know, you now have the ability as a chiropractor to provide your patients, your friends, your families with this program and let them manifest and awaken to become optimally healthy people. But think about the fact that you can actually now coach people and sign people up and get people healthy all over the, the country and the world. So it's been our pleasure being here. Thanks so much for your time, Sean. And uh, you. we hope this was uh, valuable to you. Have a great day.